The F-35 Lightning II fighter jet is a single-seat T, single-engine, all-weather, stealth, fifth-generation, multi-role combat aircraft, designed for ground attack and air superiority missions. It is built by Lockheed Martin and many subcontractors, including Northrop Grumman, Pratt, and Whitney, and BAE Systems. The F-35 has three main models, the conventional takeoff and landing F-35A, the short takeoff and vertical landing F-35B, and the catapult-assisted takeoff but arrested recovery, carrier-based F-35C. The F-35 descends from the Lockheed Martin X-35, the design that was awarded the Joint Strike Fighter program over the competing Boeing X-32. As the largest and most expensive military program ever, the F-35 became the subject of much scrutiny and criticism in the US and in other countries. In 2013 and 2014, critics argued that the plane was plagued with design flaws, with many blaming the procurement process in which Lockheed was allowed to design, test, and produce the F-35 all at the same time, instead of identifying and fixing defects before firing up its production line. By 2014, the program was $163 billion over budget seven years behind schedule. Critics also contend that the program's high sunk costs and political momentum make it too big to kill. The Pentagon's stated plan is to buy 2,663 F-35s, which will provide the bulk of the crew tactical air power of the U.S. Air Force, Navy, and Marine Corps in coming decades. Deliveries of the F-35 for the U.S. military A rescheduled until 2037 with a projected service life up to 2070. A U.S. Navy study found that the F-35 will cost 30 to 40 percent more to maintain than current jet fighters, not accounting for inflation over the F-35's operational lifetime. A Pentagon study concluded a $1 trillion maintenance cost for the entire fleet over its lifespan, not accounting for inflation. The F-35 program office found that as of January 2014, costs for the F-35 fleet over a 53-year life cycle was $857 billion. Costs for the fighter have been dropping and accounted for the 22% life cycle drop since 2010. Lockheed stated that by 2019, pricing for the fifth generation aircraft will be less than fourth generation fighters. An F 35A in 2019 is expected to cost $85 million per unit, complete with engines and full mission systems, inflation adjusted from $75 million in December 2013. The Pratt & Whitney F-135 powers the F-35. An alternative engine, the General Electric slash Rolls-Royce F-136, was being developed until it was cancelled by its manufacturers in December 2011 for lack of funding from the Pentagon. The F-135 and F-136 engines are not designed to supercruise. However, the F-35 can briefly fly at Mach 1.2 for 150 miles without the use of an afterburner. The F-135 is the second radar stealthy afterburning jet engine. Like the Pratt & Whitney F-119 from which it was derived, the F-135 has suffered afterburner pressure pulsations, or screech at low altitude and high speed. The F-35 has a maximum speed of over Ma CH 1.6. With a maximum takeoff weight of 60,000 pounds, 27,000 kilograms, the Lightning II is considerably heavier than the lightweight fighters it replaces. The Stovall F-35B is outfitted with the Rolls-Royce lift system, designed by Lockheed Martin and developed by Rolls-Royce. This system is more similar to the German VJ-101D-E than the preceding Stovall Harrier jump jet and the Rolls-Royce Pegasus engine. The lift system is composed of a lift fan, drive shaft, two roll posts and a three-bearing swivel module 3 BSM. The 3 BSM is a thrust vectoring nozzle which allows the main engine exhaust to be deflected downward at the tail of the aircraft. The lift fan is near the front of the aircraft and provides a counterbalancing thrust using two counter-rotating blisks. It is powered by the engine's low-pressure turbine via a drive shaft and gearbox. Roll control during slow flight is achieved by diverting unheated engine bypass air through wing-mounted thrust nozzles called roll posts. 
The F-35A is armed with a GAU 22-A, a, a four-barrel version of the 25mm GAU 12 equalizer cannon. The cannon is mounted internally with 182 rounds for the F-35A or in an external pod with 220 rounds for the F-35B and F-35C. The gun pod has stealth features. The software that enables operational firing of the cannon is expected to be installed by 2018. The F-35 has external hardpoints to carry missiles, bombs, and drop tanks at the expense of increased radar cross-section, and thus reduced stealth. These include four underwing pylons that can carry the AIM-120 AMRAM BVRAM, AGM-158 Joint Air-to-Surface Standoff Missile JASM Cruise Missile, and Guided Bombs, and two near wingtip pylons for the AIM-9X Sidewinder and AIM-132 ASRAM Short Range Air-to-Air Missiles. The F-35 has two internal weapons bays with a total of four weapons stations. Two of these can carry air-to-surface missiles or bombs up to 2,000 pounds (910 kilograms) each in the ANC models, or air-to-surface missiles or bombs up to 1,000 pounds (450 kilograms) each in the B model. The other two stations are for smaller weapons such as air-to-air -air missiles. The weapon bays can carry AIM-120 AMRAM. AIM-132 ASRAM, the Joint Direct Attack Munition JDAM, Paveway Series of Bombs, the Joint Standoff Weapon SO, Brimstone, Spear 3 Anti-Tank Missiles, and Cluster Munitions Wind Corrected Munitions Dispenser. An air-to-air -air missile load of 8 AIM-120s and 2 AIM-9s is possible using internal and external weapons stations, a configuration of 6, 2,000 pounds, 910 kilograms, bombs, two AIM-120s and two AIM-9s can also be arranged. Lockheed Martin states that the weapons load can be configured as all air-to-ground or all air-to-air, -air, and has suggested that a Block 5 version will carry three weapons per bay instead of two, replacing the heavy bomb with two smaller weapons such as AIM-120 AMRAM air-to-air -air missiles. Upgrades are to allow each weapons bay to carry four GBU-39 small diameter bombs, SDB, for ANC models, or three in F-35B. The F-35 has a lower radar cross-section than the preceding generation of fighters, thanks to its shape and the use of fiber mat and other stealthy, radar-absorbent materials. It is also designed to have lower infrared and visual signatures. The F-35's radar-absorbent materials are designed to be more durable and require less maintenance than those on the F-117, B-2, and F-22. At some frequencies, the F-35 compares favorably to the F-22 in stealth, according to General Mike Hostage, commander of the Air Combat Command. Low-frequency radars can spot stealthy aircraft because of Rayleigh scattering, but such radars are also conspicuous, susceptible to clutter, and have low precision. The F-35's anti-radar design is primarily focused on the higher frequency X-band used by missile lock and targeting sensors, rendering them ineffective beyond close ranges. Ground crews use repair verification radar test sets to ensure that a given repair has not increased its radar signature, which is not a concern for N on stealth aircraft. In 2008, Air Force officials said the F-35 would be about twice as loud as the McDonnell Douglas F-15 Eagle at takeoff and up to four times as loud during landing. This led residents near two potential F-35 bases, Luke Air Force Base Arizona and Eglin Air Force Base Florida, to request environmental impact studies about the jet's noise. But in October 2014, the Joint Strike Fighter Program Office said that the F-35B's takeoff noise was only 2 decibels higher than a Super Hornet, a virtually indistinguishable difference to the human ear, and is even 10 decibels quieter when flying formations or landing. Thank you for watching this clip. If you want more videos and clips like this please support us by subscribing, ring the bell and thumbs up. Remember. Peace through strength.